So this curriculum is very fun. It uses a lot of hands-on, scientific, fingerprints, questions, and biblical passages to help explain to children who God is, why we know He exists, what's in the Bible. In hot pursuit of the absolute truth. So it's a fun opportunity to be able to get immersed in Bible stories and fun and crafts, things that help instill the message that we're trying to give to these kids. It's a fun time and it's an exciting time. You get to build relationships not only with the kids that you work with, but also with the workers that you work alongside. It strengthens the body of Christ and also reaches out to the community around us. Build things, paint, assemble, cut out, craft, snack innovations for our children, and we still need a lot of prayer. International Spy Academy, agents of the one to go. Okay, just got the kids to go to bed and I thought I'd just check in with Fairview real quick and ask you please be praying for the Pastor Search Committee. They need prayers for wisdom and that the Holy Spirit helps them find the next pastor for Fairview Church. We have a prayer guide. Uh, if you need a copy of that, you can get it out in the credenza in the hallway or online. To download the prayer guide, go to www.fairviewchurch.org, hover over resources, and click Pastor Search. Scroll down the page and click the Pastor Search Prayer Guide link. This weekly updated guide provides a seven-day set of verses to help focus our prayer for the next pastor. And don't forget, on July 20th at 6 p.m., David Moore is going to be coming back to give us the results of the listening workshop. Make sure you stick around afterwards because we're going to be having some ice cream. Did you say ice cream? <laughs> we have a correspondent on the scene with a live report. I'm standing in a classroom that just hours ago was the site of giggling, coloring, and little wooden trucks zooming around. It's hard to believe, but every Sunday morning during the main worship service, respectable adults, like me, wear their less than formal attire and spend the hour crawling on the floor, reading books and Bible stories to little cutie pies, and pushing them on swings. It's not surprising to learn that it's often difficult to find adults willing to trade their time in the worship service to work in this way one out of every six weeks. It is an arduous task. Organizers are working to recruit people who are willing to assist in this task. Reporting from Fairview Baptist Church's Children's Classroom, I'm Tracy Griggs.